Welcome back to DrupalHowTos.com. I'm the person that owns this blog, Drupal Web Hosting, at Drupal How Tos. I encourage you to go to my web hosting review site. This is me here in the picture. My name is Renee C. And I welcome you to my video on understanding views better using mind maps. Take a moment to read this little message here. And also, please watch some of the video tutorials that I've created for free in the video section on the top tab. Relax, enjoy, and have a wild and wonderful ride. In this tutorial, I'm going to talk further about views. <clears throat> Let me locate my mind map folder. And go to the views folder. Using views module you can create different list of nodes. We reviewed this earlier with my first YouTube video which is titled what is views. In the views user interface once you've downloaded views at drupal.org forward slash project forward slash views you're going to be able to enable the views UI and when you do that there are quite a few sections that you need to be aware of notice this lady is putting all her dead leaves into this little contraption and it puts it in a bag so what she's doing is she's filtering her leaves so the views allowed you to filter and let you show your visitors what type of nodes that you want to display on those lists so two common things that we do when we set up views if it's just a basic view is we go to the filter field and we're going to click on node equals published because we want all the views to show that are nodes that have been published. The second thing is we're going to want to select node type. When you do that, you're going to come up with another box and if you've enabled a blog in the forum and the poll, I created a custom content type called cell phone page or story you can hi highlight one of these to go and select and create a views list of one of these content types you can use views to lay out your content this is a views list of different book covers you can also use views to create a views list using the bonus grid to create thumbnails of videos. Which is shown right here. If you click on my video page, I've used views and clicked on the bonus view grid and it shows me a views, a list of videos. And I create the page called media slash video. This concludes my mind maps illustration. I created these mind maps because I found it difficult to understand views. And using my artistic ability, I was able to create mind maps for myself to make it easier for me to understand. So I hope you've really enjoyed this video and take some time to absorb what I've said. If you want a further detailed discussion on how to create views, please go to easydrupaltutorials.com. Thank you for watching.